Hi everyone, Giuliano here. In this video, I'm going to show you my tip how to block and book time in your Outlook calendar for tasks using Microsoft To Do. This is a very nice approach to structure better your work. Moreover, you can easily report to your manager using your calendar. It's extremely easy to see what you have done in the previous weeks and what you have planned to do in the next Using Microsoft To Do, it's extremely easy to choose a task and then focus and dedicate time for that specific task. Okay, let's get started and I'll show you every step. Here I am in office.com. I'm going to click on the waffle menu in the left upper corner and then on Microsoft To Do. Here I have a tasks list and here, as you can see, I have a bunch of tasks. Now I show you how you can drag and drop this task directly in the Outlook calendar. Luckily, I already have a tab open here. Now, let me open the calendar in Outlook. I'm going to click on the icon and this is the week view. Now, in the upper right corner, let's click on My Day icon. This will open a panel and here I have two people. I have Calendar and To Do. In To Do, I have listed all tasks. Now let's say that I want to allocate time to complete this task, organize the onboarding for Philip. All I need to do is select this task, drag and drop it for tomorrow. And now I planned 30 minutes to complete this task. Of course, I can rearrange this time slot, let's say two hours, and then this task will be completed. So this is a normal event item placed in the calendar. So I can edit it, I can reschedule the time slot, I can click on more options and here I have all classic features to handle event in Outlook calendar. I can do the same for other. For example, I want to also face this other task, schedule a meeting with a customer X and this will take just half an hour and then I can add additional tasks if I want. This is how it works in Outlook for web. Now I'll show you also how it works if you are working with the board view of the Outlook calendar. Now here I have this uh, drop down, clicking on a week, I can change the view and I can select board. What you can do here is use always this panel, my day, or if you want, you can use directly this add-on in, available in board view to handle tasks. This is this one. Now I can do the same here. I can select this other task, for example, contact HR, and I can place it on the calendar. So this is an alternative way. Instead of opening the My Day panel, you can directly interact on the board view of Outlook calendar with the plugin, with the add-on tasks and calendar. Now let's see how you can do the same thing on Outlook for desktop. I am in Outlook for desktop. Now let me open the calendar and now I have to display the tasks list. To do that, let's go on view and then on layout and finally to do bar and tasks. Now I have my tasks list here available. Now I will change the view and I'm going to select week. And here basically you can do the same. I'm going to select this task and then I'm going to drop it exactly here in this day. So here I can do the same, I can expand the time slot for this task and so on. Now, it's important to note that if you set this task as completed, the event on the calendar will remain. So let me mark as completed this, and as you can see, this uh, time slot is still allocated for that. This is the best feature, for my opinion, of this use case, because Working in that way, you have always the ability to have an history on your calendar. You can see what you have done yesterday and in the previous days. All right, we have seen in this video how to use Microsoft To Do to block and book time for your tasks in your Outlook calendar. If you enjoyed this video, please consider to subscribe, comment, like. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time.